So when getting ready for summer, I always suggest to use a great scrub because it'll really get your skin nice and smooth and prep for any bronzers or self tanners that you may use. Now it's super important to make sure you protect your skin, at least use an SPF 30. For a complexion, I suggest using waterproof products. We're going to be using Makeup Forever's Face and Body, which is amazing. I can't tell you guys how much I love this foundation for the summer. It's lightweight, it doesn't feel like you're wearing a lot, and it's waterproof. So I like to buff it on with a buffing brush. It prevents any streaking and it also creates more of a lightweight to medium coverage. Then take your concealer, waterproof concealer, and just give a little bit extra coverage to those areas that need it, like under the eyes, any areas of redness, and go ahead and cover there. The waterproof concealer will prevent any creasing under the eye as well. You can also put it on the lid of your eye to prep for any eyeshadow that you may be using. It'll also help waterproof and keep that on. Now when it comes to bronzer, I like to use a matte bronzer to contour. It'll really give you that nice glow, summer sun-kissed look, as well as give you that nice chiseled look, which is also amazing. You want to also use it on your forehead since the sun usually will go there when you have a sun-kissed look, so you want to get that overall look. Now, a great tip is to use a blending brush in your crease with the bronzer. It will also give just a hint of color and give a little bit of contour to your eye area. Use that same brush to do a little contouring on the nose if you like. You can also increase the pout of your lip, doing so with a blending brush as well. So now that we have prepped our skin, I will be showing you the first look and that's how to create a look with colorful lips. And it looks really cute with sunglasses by the way. So first you want to do a simple eye look. You can create a bold liner look like I did with waterproof eyeliner or you can just add a hint of waterproof liner. Now when creating the lips, what you can do is use a waterproof lip liner. Go ahead and do the bow of your lips first, then the corners of your lips, then the very bottom of your pout, and then just connect those lines. It's a really easy trick on lining your lips to get that perfect lip liner. Then you want to fill in your entire lip with the waterproof lip liner. This will make sure that your lip is waterproof and ready to go for all day wear. Your lips are completely filled in with the liner. Go ahead and add on your lipstick. I'm using this gorgeous color called Summer. It's a little bit lighter than my lip liner, so it's actually going to create a bigger pout by adding it mostly just to the inner parts of your lip. Now here's our second summer look with a pop of color on the eyes. Having already done the previous steps to prep our skin and contour, go ahead and highlight under the brow and in the inner corner of the eye. Next, take dark brown eyeshadow, blend it onto your lash line, taking it to the corner of your eye and then into the crease. This will create sort of a V shape. Then you want to go ahead and use waterproof eyeliner and add it to your lash line. You can create a bold look like I did with the cat eye here, or you can do a little bit more simple. Either way, make a waterproof liner. Then take a nice black shadow, adding it to the corner of your eyes. This will create more of a dramatic effect. You want to go ahead and blend from the outer corner going inwards in your crease. And now for our pop of color, you want to take some waterproof eyeliners. First I'm going to be using green, then it'll go into a lighter blue, and then a darker blue.
Lastly, finish with lashes. Or if you don't want to wear false lashes, you can definitely use a great waterproof mascara to finish off your look. Now for the lips, here's some really great waterproof options. I love using the Smashbox Waterproof Medium Lip Liner. And then also Makeup Forever has a great cream base that you can use for your lips and your cheeks. So you can finish off the lips with a cute gloss and then you're done with your summer look. You look super cute and colorful for the summer.